Hi guys, my name is Luca Del Tongo. I'm an Italian computer science student. And uh, in this tutorial, I want to show you how to do eye detection using um, an OpenCV wrapper called MDUCV. MDUCV is a very active uh, C Sharp wrapper. And uh, now uh, let's fire up Visual Studio and see the step necessary to do eye detection. First of, all, first of all, we have to declare some uh, variables and uh, we have to declare a capture variable to acquire, to grab frames from our webcam. After we have two hard cascade uh, classifier, one for faces and one for eyes, the classifier cascade for face is necessary because this enforces the detection of the eyes because eyes are inside our face so in the constructor of form of our windows form we have uh, we initialize our classes and after we attach an event handler to the application idle event the first step required is to uh, declare an image frame and uh, acquire a frame from webcam. I like uh, MDU CV strong, uh, strong type because uh, as you can see we have an image and we declare that uh, this image is a BGR image with a 8 bit per channel. So three channel, eight bit per channel, one byte. After that we have grab our frame, our image, we convert it to grayscale and we equalize our frame to increase our performance. The first step is to acquire our face detected using the detected hard cascade function. There are some param parameters to adjust and um, after that we consider that there are only one face in this frame to increase and to be more precise about our detection uh, we can uh, define uh, some uh, region of interest in particular using the metric of our face so First of all, we declare some ips, x and y coordinates to search for our eyes. We divide our face and um, we can think um, of uh, about that our face, um, our eyes very probably will be at the top of our face and so we set uh, here a small fraction of our face, the, the top part and after this simple code that we have I've written down to define some search area we have some drawing function utilities that displays our search area after that we define our region of interest for detect our left eye we are detecting our eyes we clear up the re region of interesting setting set it before we detect with similar code our right eyes and after we can draw our eyes using this class so let's see a simple demo As you can see, my eyes are detected and um, here I have written the search area that I have used to define where more probably will be my left or right eyes. As you can see, define some search area 
remove some possible outlier because we are bounded to search eyes in our search areas previously defined. I want to show you another approach I have written down and it's based on half circles detection so we can model our eyes as simple circle now I will comment this code and we'll take a look at the half circle code that previously was commented now I will comment out this code oh, sorry so we simple detect the circle present that lie in our left eye region of interest after we display our circle circles having previously adjusted their offset relative to the region of interest same code very similar code for the right eye so let's see how does our form changes as you can see my, my eyes are detected with some blue circle not in every frame as you can see it depends on the very very particular half parameter so this is a very very basic approach but I think that this approach could be uh, improved and I'm trying to improve this code I hope you like this tutorial